welcome to Belize. So happy to be here, it feels amazing. The sun feels so good. I'm so excited to be here. My whole family is here and we've been here for a couple days already just enjoying it, soaking it up. If you are new here, I was born and raised in Belize and so I'm here to see my family. My parents are still here and some of my siblings. We're so excited to be here and I'm just gonna pick up my camera and vlog little bits of my trip. I'm not gonna be filming just like a ton, but I do wanna show you guys just a little bit of life down here and for my own memory's sake too, it's just gonna be so much fun to like look back on this video later on. So let me know in the comments down below if you've ever been to Belize, if you've ever lived here or visited or anything like that, I'd love to know. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna do today is I'm gonna actually meet my friend Andrea and we're just gonna do our favorite thing, walk around town, eat. It's basically gonna be a food tour. Actually, this whole video is probably gonna be a food vlog. My favorite food is from this country. So fruits or anything like that. I, ah, I always look forward to it the whole year. <laughs> look here, this is my friend Andrea. You've seen her in the last Belize vlog. So everyone's ready to hit this rice and beans really hard. Tostadas. Hey, Zammer. Hey. Are you sitting with Auntie Andrea? Four, four dimes, four dollars. Oh, golden plum. <gasps> right there. I want like five dollars then. I smell tamalitos. <gasps> it is yes, popcorn. right here. Oh my word, I'm getting some of this too. And the pepper, oh my word. Yes, Lord. Getting some of that, getting some of that. So many little fruits and stuff that I absolutely crave in this. Buying so many little things. This thing is full already. Hi, Shogi. I think strawberries are expensive in the US. It's like not even full. It's like empty. It's crazy. Getting some groceries. Dude, it's been a minute. Yes. Oh, I should buy some of these. They're so good. Give me a pack. Oh. <laughs> oh, I mean, it's been years since I've had these. Oh, I'm looking. I found my hot sauce. Where's my hot sauce? I don't even see it. This stuff is always super good. And this stuff. Literally all these. Lime squeezer, lemon, four tortillas, tortilla press, corn tortillas. This is a kamal to make flour tortillas on. Snacks for days. Hey. So good. Do you get the one with milk? Oh yeah. Food coloring for days. Oh. <laughs> it's so good. Thank you. You bought some ice. So it's basically yes. like Hawaiian shaved ice, probably, right? With flavoring on there and evaporated milk. So delicious. It is so refreshing. Oh my goodness. This, this guy's selling Africa. orchids. And this other one is Amazon. It's Belize's national Amazon. flower. They have beautiful Amazon. orchids down here. Yeah, they're so pretty. You want some boiled corn? This is like field corn in the States. This would be basically like field corn. It's not sweet corn. Love it, we eat it with pepper, hot pepper and salt and lime down here. Or like sour cream, mayonnaise, salt, pepper, lime. That whole vibe is delicious. Hi. Say hi, did you have fun? Hi. <laughs> She's just like waving. Oh, that is so nice. I'm gonna go buy some Coke. And one spray. Look at the little sweat. You got sweat already? Well, look at it! Oh, Who hey, shows so. up? <laughs> Say hi to the YouTube fam. Hey, YouTube. Hi. This hi, is my on. nephew, my brother, and his uh, fiance. <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah, New girlfriend and um, Finley. Finley. You want to ride? Hold on. Hold on to her. <laughs> this is my mom and dad's house. <laughs> Are 
you go swing in with grandma. Hi. Do you bite? Do you bite? Can you share? Do you bite? Hanging out by the river. We used to swim here every single day growing up. Just about every hot day we would come and swim down here in the Rio Hondo. Some crocodiles in there, but it was all fine. We love swimming here. It's just the most refreshing thing. Close to home, close to home. walk down here, eat some frozen ideals, and swim. Bring our mangoes, green mangoes. Amazing. So many memories here. Summer, does it feel good? It feels good. Yeah. This is the longest line getting heading into Mexico that we've ever experienced. Long. Chetama hot dogs are well known and they're wrapped in bacon and ham. Pretty good. Most of the time. Some of the time I don't really like it, but it's really good. I like the police ones better. I did fabric shopping like the good Mennonite that I am. Can't go to Mexico and not go fabric shopping. The fabric is really cheap and the quality is pretty good, so hitting up the store. Boom. So, very favorite place to eat tacos in Chetamal. The best tacos I personally have ever, 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 ever had are always from this restaurant. So good. So good. Can't be beaten. So one of my goals this year is just to take the time to be more creative. And one way I'm doing that is by watching Skillshare classes. Skillshare is sponsoring today's video. I'm so grateful for that. They have thousands of online classes. What I've been enjoying is like soap making classes or bar soap or how to decorate cakes better or maybe design my home a little better. Watercolor paintings, photography. One that I find really, really soothing is a class on arranging florals. The class is called Centerpiece Design. Creating a stunning table arrangement, that kind of thing. Just tickles me. You might want to like invest in your business or learn um, maybe like wedding photography or really invest in your Etsy business this year and you don't really know how to start. Skillshare might be just the thing for you. They have thousands of online classes ad free so you can really zone in, focus, you can sign up with my link down below. First 1,000 of my subscribers will get 30 days of Skillshare for free and you can cancel at any time. It's no risk. Thank you Skillshare for sponsoring today's video and let's move on to the rest of the video. We've been having such a good time, but you know how it is when you're with friends and family, um, when you're having such a good time, you don't even feel like picking up your phone or your camera. So I haven't been, I haven't been vlogging hardly anything, but hopefully I can get some more done the next couple days. But we've been having such a good time, eating so much good food, enjoying the sunshine. It's just been gorgeous weather down here. Not very much humidity and blue skies. Oh, it's just been so gorgeous. Here he goes, we head for lunch at Granny's house. Yep. Dogs are like the soundtrack to Belize village life. Should burn little yippy dogs. That's like that's like the music of little villages down here. Buying some tortillas, corn tortillas. Go babe. Summer. Elliot, let's go, babe. Bye. Bye. Okay, bye. This is my brother Caleb's house, his wife Chris. They've been married only like a year or two. Caleb, Troy's up there cleaning the roof. 
Working hard. Summer, there's the. There's Dada. Gotta be careful up there. Mom is running for the tamales. You decide to eat tamales? In town, my sister's right now just picking up a few groceries. I'm gonna show you the prices. 10.50, half a gallon of milk. Stop complaining about US food prices. Butter, 15.79. Yep, inflation. So the prices are really expensive down here. Grocery food, grocery food prices because uh, everything, almost everything is imported. And so you can basically say that it's about three times more expensive for most groceries. Groceries, Maybe not the basic things like rice and beans, but everything else, very expensive. Getting some veggies. Fresh beans. <laughs> How much for one? All right. Custard apple. Custard apple. They're good when they're ripe, but this is what I want right here. Hello. Hi. How much for one? One dollar right. Maybe I'll take this one right here. The small one. The big one. Con chile. Uh -huh. Thank you, miss. Seven for some tacos. So hungry. If you know, you know. How are these little guys so good? They look, <laughs> look at them. They're so stinking good. Asian barbecue. My goodness. I crave this so much at home. Mmm, so good. Eating some tabutas. Favorite some watermelon. The view. These are so good. Oh. These are salbutas, this lady right from church she makes them. They are just unbelievable. They're so good. Nothing like mom's Sunday lunch. Good morning, our last full day in Belize. It's hard to believe, it's really sad. I don't think I've ever been so depressed to go home because we've had a great time and just going home to the middle of winter. <sighs> Anyways, this does not make me very happy, but I'm so glad we were able to come. We're gonna enjoy our last full day here. We're gonna eat some tacos. My whole family is, or pretty much the whole family is in town this morning getting um, orange walk tacos. You know what I'm talking about? You know they're just so, so good. They don't even look good, but they're so good. So we're gonna have a good day. We're gonna go swimming later on this afternoon and just try to enjoy our last day, our last full day here. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Um, I know it was not very organized. I had a lot of different footage flopped around here and there. Very, very, much, very little talking, but um, like I said, I did it for my, my own memory's sake as much as anything. So Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. This is the taco stand. They also have tostadas, empanadas. This is Josh. Josh. He's acting super right now. All right. And they're watching.
watermelon juice is so good. I don't know if other countries do watermelon juice or not. My thing is not focusing. But it's so refreshing and then it's orange juice, fresh orange juice. Goes amazing with tacos. I can't see Lily. Where's Lily? There's Lily. So these are the tacos right here. They have chicken in them and they're only eaten for breakfast and the lifespan of tacos are very, very short. So they have to be eaten hot, fresh. They are so tasty, they're so good. Not much to look at. Um, but then you have it with like this little pepper sauce right here. And you dip it in. They're just amazing. It's the number one, my number one favorite Belizean food that I miss when I'm home. So they're so, so good. I wish you guys could all taste them. He doesn't like the juice. Watermelon juice. It's so slushy and cold. Oh, it's so good. Like, mm, 10 10 recommend. Hi, Shogi. You're so bright. Hi. You're so bright. Plants and chips. Got some plants and chips. And then I some reason crave these little. Those things are disgusting. I, I love these things. things. They got like marshmallows and crackers. Oh, they're so gross. I've always hated them. We sell water in bags here for 25 cents. Just in a little bag. Truck full of pineapples. You have not really had a pineapple until you had one in Central America or any tropical country. Oh, I don't even eat pineapples in the States, but these are so good. Fresh pineapple. Where you get on the bus to go home. The one thing I miss about living in, where I live in the States is that there's not bus service. To so go, always go to town, just hop on a bus quickly and come back. Mom found this beautiful place to swim. It's a couple miles from our house, or mom's, mom's house in Blaze, and it's just beautiful. This is something that I did not grow up with. I don't remember, I have no memories of swimming in pools in Belize, but man, it's just perfect. Perfect place to have a picnic, eat. It's not that crazy expensive. So it's just a, we're gonna have a really fun day here. It's just so relaxing and beautiful, gorgeous day. Kids are just loving it. Hey, Shogi. Hey! Good She's mommy. looking down. Hi! Taking a walk in the village. Hello. Here we go. Hi. Say hi. One, two, three. We are walking down the village there's a river we used to swim at all the time and just enjoying this beautiful evening I love this little village you walking this is where I attended school for a couple years I was a bad little kid too <laughs> sorry about that teachers <laughs> One last Coca-Cola before we leave. We are on our way to the airport. So pretty sad about leaving, but it was such a good trip. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you found it interesting. If you've never visited Belize, uh, come, come visit. I think you would like it. <laughs>